Hello everyone and welcome to the Cypress tutorial. In this tutorial, we will learn to test the REST API with the POST method and we will also be using the chat GPT. So let's begin. In our previous tutorial, we learned that how we can test the REST API with the GET method and in this particular tutorial, we will be testing the REST API with the POST method. So for this tutorial, I will be using the same website called dummyrestepiexample.com. For that, let's go to the browser here. And this is a website here and here you will find the different APIs with the different methods. So this is a post call here and the method is post. So we can create an employee using this particular full route. And here we can see the details here. Click on this one because we are creating a new employee. So we need to provide some data here. So let me click on this one and let's see. So this is a sample JSON here. We can provide this JSON and we can create a user. So let me go back here and yes, so this is the one. So first we will uh, use this API in the Postman and then we will see how we can create our automated test in Cypress. So let me copy this URL from here and go to the Postman here and let me paste this one here. Now we have this method as a post and inside the body we need to provide a json here so let me go back here and let me open the details here yes this is a json let me copy this one from here and let me go to postman here and here we need to select as a json and that's it and now let's send this one and see what happens here so the user has been created successfully. The name of user is this, salary is this, age this, and ID is this. Now uh, let's go to the Visual Studio code here and let me create one new file and let me name it as post.postapi.js. Okay. And let me copy the code from the previous example here and paste it here so what i'll do is that let me update this one from here instead of get this is a post learning post api post api testing and now we need to provide the this particular url here for this let me go here and let me copy the url from here let me copy this one and go to visual studio code and besides uh, providing the url here there are two more things one is a method because we need to tell the server that this is a post call and the data this is a json payload which we need to send right so this is a json one so we both we need to provide both of these things in order to work with this post call okay so let me go here and here so first here we'll provide a method so this is a post and then what we need to do is that we need to provide a json so let me go to the browser and let's copy this one from here and let's format this one so format json and this is a json formatter let me open this one and let me provide this one here so this is a formatted way so let me copy this one and now here i will paste this one so uh, you know that's it we are done with the post call and let me remove this one from here and this one from here so the status code will be equal to 200 this is our session right and this is a payload which we are expecting in a response so let me copy this one from here and let me paste it here and let me change the this one from here so basically this complete from here and paste it here and we are expecting to have a property called message 
so message successfully record has been added so let me copy this one from here and go back here so change it to the new one and yes uh, we are done with this uh, sessions as well so let me say this one and now let's go to the test runner here and run this one and see what happens here so object is deeply equals to so this assertion is failing because we are sending some different payload here but the rest assertions are passed but this is how actually we can test the post api now let me go to the browser here and let's see what chat gpt is saying about this one so how to test rest api with the post method in cypress so let's see what chat gpt says so here is the example cy.request yes we are using cy.request we are using post then we are using an endpoint or the url we are providing a payload here and then we are resolving this one and we are putting the assertions here yes exactly that's what we have done and this is 100 percent accurate in terms of automating the post call using the cypress thank you so much for watching this tutorial if you like our content then do like comment share and subscribe our channel once again thank you so much and see you in the next tutorial